cooling, broken water pipes. When a component fails, most places operation is money. We have to evaluate the situation, respond, and get it back online as soon as possible. Property managers would benefit wonderfully from, from one of these cameras. The flare infrared camera would, would help you identify the, the source of the problem much quicker than a uh, conventional troubleshooting method. With an infrared camera, you're seeing beyond what your, what your eye can see. As soon as you turn it on, you'll see a distinct color difference across your component. It would stick out just like a sore thumb. Here's where your problem is. This is where it's originating. With the camera, it enables us to go out and do preventive maintenance. It's a service that in most facilities you never get to do because of the expense. It's quite expensive to go out and hire that service. Depending upon how big your building is or how many buildings you have, uh, you know, do the math. The flare camera is affordable and having it in-house... You wouldn't have to uh, call in someone to, to do an annual inspection. If you had your own camera, you could now see things before it gets to the point of a vibration, before it gets to the point of an overheating, and you'll know that my system's either running correctly at this point or it's something that needs to be addressed at a future time. You can schedule the repairs rather than have an emergency repair. You can not only check existing systems, you can check new installations to make sure they're installed correctly. Now that I've used the camera, I just got the bug. I'm ready to go as far as you know I can with it. The FLIR infrared cameras are, are real easy to use. It's lightweight. You can train someone to, to use it within a, a few minutes. It's point and shoot. The controls are easy to operate. A FLIR infrared camera should be part of any facility. This just makes your job a lot easier. You're able to find problems, repair them, resolve them, rather than have to react to a, to a failed system. It's money savings bottom line. Either by man hours or the amount of time that's spent on emergency breakdowns. It would be nice if the guy that is watching after your property has the ability to see where the naked eye can't see and maybe mitigate a loss before the loss even occurs.